heading out to see the Avro Aero here at the Eaton Vale Aerodome. That's from the subway construction in Toronto. I guess the Scarborough subway. Um, the MiG was uh, the first military aircraft that was jet propelled. Uh, the Germans had a few, but they didn't. Uh, they didn't uh, last very long. Um, uh, but Look at this. Yeah. <laughs> of course. Arrow arrow. No, there'll be a um, lot, lot of opportunity. You can take as many pictures in here as you want. Nothing is top secret anymore. <laughs> so. Wow. Bob down there. Bob can answer any of your questions too. Probably more questions than I can. And today, everything, pretty much everything in here was Cold War focused. Um, and of course, the era was born because of the Cold War. Uh, but I'd like to start by talking a little bit about the rapid advance of aviation technology. As I explained, uh, the, sec the air war was not a prominent part of World War I, uh, mainly because um, the war started only about. That's beautiful. The Avro Arrow. Ejection seats were actually built in Collingwood, Collingwood, Ontario. Yep, there it is. There in Collingwood, Martin Baker Aircraft Company Limited, Collingwood, Ontario. Well, oh, check that out. So cool. There's a QR code. Look at this, a lot of beauty. If you, anybody can get out here to see this, I highly recommend it. Wow. This was built for the CBC Made for TV movie of the Avro. I believe this one was it, or the other one beside me. I'm gonna check. Oh, maybe this was one. This was the one made for the TV movie, or the one behind me? That's right, this one here. This was it, eh? Wow, <laughs> some engine. Yeah. I love how they put it right beside to show what's inside the. Wow. That is amazing. Oh, that all gets up in the air. <laughs> yeah, the plane had a range of 820 miles, but they they figured that once the Arenda engine was inside it, once the air car was inside it, it probably would have been at least 30% better than that. Oh my goodness, wow. Well. Fuel, uh, fuel tanks. Oh, okay. Board. All in the wing or somewhere else? Uh, somewhere in the wings. A lot of the fuselage, right? Oh, wow. But the fuselage also had room for eight missiles inside. Wow. Yeah. So it, they have a Tiger Moth next door that they'll pick you up in. Um, in box for 20 minutes. <laughs> so if you want to walk there's a lot to see here. Come 
bottles. Interesting, worker, interesting stories here, I guess, about the couple of workers. I'll check into it in a little bit here, and there's a QR code to scan. Regarding that, I'll see if I can scan that later. Really cool. Okay, I'm gonna do some photos now if I can. The Avro Arrow. There you have it.